Alligators and Crocodiles by National Geographic Kids, written by Laura Marsh. Guess what's different? Snap! What big teeth you have! Crocodiles and alligators look alike. They both have huge jaws with pointed teeth. They both have long tails. Bumpy plates cover their bodies. But crocodiles and alligators are different. How can you tell them apart? Hmm, can you tell which is the alligator and which is the crocodile? Well, the alligator is on the bottom and the crocodile is on the top. Alligators have a wide snout. It is rounded and U-shaped and alligators are usually a dark color. A snout is an animal's nose and mouth that stick out from its face. Alligators usually live in fresh water. Crocodiles have a thinner snout. It is pointed and V-shaped. Crocodiles are lighter in color than alligators, and crocodiles usually live in salt water. A pile of reptiles. Through, though alligators and crocodiles are different, they are both reptiles. A reptile's body has scales or bony plates. Snakes and lizards are reptiles with scales, and alligators and crocodiles are reptiles with bony plates called shoots. Both scales and shoots help protect reptiles' bodies. Around the world, alligators and crocodiles belong to a group of reptiles called crocodilians. There are 25 different kinds of crocodilians. They usually live in warm areas around the world. Crocodilians are never far from the water. They spend a lot of time in the ponds, lakes, marshes, wetlands, rivers, and swamps. Perfect for the water. Alligators and crocodiles are built for living in the water. Both alligators and crocodiles have these parts. Ears, eyelids, lungs, tails, feet, bodies, nostrils, and eyes. The ears are slits on its head and they close underwater. The lungs hold its breath for up to two hours when it's underwater. A strong tail pushes its big body through the water and its feet are webbed like flippers. They help the crocodilian swim through quick water. It floats easily and the eyelids on top and the bottom are clear, and it protects the eyes underwater. Nostrils are on top of its snout, eyes on top of its head. A crocodilian can breathe and see while the rest of its body is underwater. Crocodilians have excellent senses. They can see, smell, and hear better than other reptiles. They see much better in the dark than we do. Crocodilians have a special skin too. They can feel something moving nearby in muddy water when they easily find their prey. Grabbing dinner, crocodilians are carnivores, which means they eat meat. However, they are not picky eaters. All kinds of fish, insects, bird, frogs, snakes, and mammals make a tasty meal. Even big animals such as antelope and buffalo are on the menu. Alligators and crocodiles can go for months without eating, but when they're hungry, watch out. A crocodilian waits for its prey to get close. Then it shoots out the water and grabs the animal. Its big, strong jaws hold the prey underwater to drown it, and the crocodilian gulps down its dinner. Seven fun facts about crocodilians. One, alligator teeth are hollow. Two, there is only one place on earth where you can find both alligators and crocodiles in the wild, and that's the southern Florida in the U.S. Number three, crocodilians lose their teeth and get new ones all through their lives. Number four, crocodilians grow a lot. Newly hatched young are less than a foot long, but adults are 10 to 20 feet long. Number five, some crocodilians lay up to 90 eggs at one time. That's a lot of babies. Number six, mothers come running or swimming when they hear their young call for help. Like lions, crocodilians can roar. King of the Crocs. The largest crocodilian is the saltwater crocodile. It can grow to more than 20 feet long and weigh over 2,200 pounds. It is an excellent swimmer and can travel far out to sea. Saltwater crocodiles may be the most dangerous crocodilians of all time. They are most likely to attack, and they are deadly. A saltwater crocodile feeds in a sanctuary in Australia. 
nest and nursery. Most reptiles lay their eggs and leave, but crocodilians stick around. They stay close to the nest and protect their young. Some kinds of crocodilians build a mound of plants, mud, and leaves for a nest, but other kinds of crocodilians dig a hole for a nest. A mother crocodilian waits for a few months. When she hears squeaks from the eggs, she uncovers the nest. The eggs begin to hatch. The mother gently carries the hatchlings in her mouth. She takes them to the water for their first swim, and they're off. Endangered. New crocodilians hatch every year, but sometimes more animals die than hatch. Crocodilians can become endangered. American alligators were once endangered. Then laws were made to protect them. Their numbers grew. Now there are over one million American alligators alive today. Other crocodilians are now endangered. What can you do to help save these cool crocs and alligators? Hmm. The Morlitz crocodile or Mexican crocodile was once endangered. Now it is listed as least of concern. Most endangered species is in the Philippine is the Philippine crocodile, and there are only 250 of them left in the wild. Endangered is at risk of dying out completely. The end. If you'd like to take the quiz or look at the vocabulary, please pause the video and do so now. Thanks for watching.